Apple Music in iOS 10 has been completely redesigned. Here's what to expect. So the Apple Music app has been simplified to make it easier to find what you're looking for. There are bold headlines and clear lists and a big focus on album art when searching for and playing a song. Now you have five tabs at the bottom. You have your library, for you, browse, radio, and search. In the library tab, you have all the music that you've added to your library. This includes music of your own and music that you've added from Apple Music. Now, there's also a clear section to show songs that are actually downloaded onto your device, and it makes sorting through those songs easier. And when searching, you get everything you'd expect. Your playlists, songs, genres, all those things are here. In the For You section, you get recommendations of new music to listen to based on what you like and what you've listened to before. And this isn't too much different from what you had in Apple Music before, but now you get a better mix of music and you get new playlists every single day. The new Browse tab is where you go to browse new music. This shows curated playlists and the top charts and makes it easier to see what music is popular right now. The Radio tab hasn't changed much and this is where you can access Beats 1 and the different radio streaming stations. And finally, the search tab is where you can search for any song both in Apple Music and in your library. There's no longer a connect tab which used to hold the social networking service for artists, but the service itself is still here and it's held in the For You section. One new feature is music lyrics when listening to songs, and that is held below the album art. You just scroll up and you can have lyrics to the song. So those are the big new changes in Apple Music for iOS 10. This is still a beta, so things may change, but it gives us a good idea of what to expect when iOS 10 is released in the fall. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, be sure to subscribe to see when new videos are out and visit MacRumors.com for more. Thank you all for watching. I'm Mac Gonzalez with MacRumors, and I'll see you next time.